I would use the term of one of the Dadaists, of Kurt Schwitters, who said that Dada is uh, the spiritual or mental function of a human being. I learned that Dada is like Zen. It's very simple. Dada is to combine contradictions and to, to be able to be exactly in between these contradictions. If you ask me, I would define it a very short time movement with a great impact. It's a movement of only six, seven, eight years, but the, their impact, the impact of this movement can be seen till today. Till today, artists are influenced by Dada. And at the 20th century, not only art was influenced by Dada, but also literature, uh, poetry, uh, architecture, because it was a very, very small but strong movement that you can, if you see the tent, it was just spread around all around the world. I think if people still want to have this here and are interested and want to learn about it, there's a certain relevance or question that Dada might, could be able to help. And we have this rescue tent over here, so we think we can do like emergency uh, aids for uh, contemporary art. art shows the intensity of life, then it is a, a good artwork. And that doesn't depend on the size or on color or technique, it's more about, let's say, the idea that is in, in the artwork. Like Hugo Ball said about Kandinsky, a good artwork is then a good artwork when you see art and not the artwork. Thank mm -hmm. you.